I can't even tell that I'm on camera. So, polarized glasses make it impossible to see the thing. But what's going on, guys? I uh, brought a Diet A&W to keep me company. No better company than a Diet A&W. I actually think I like it better now than the Diet Sunkiss, so. Mm. So we are going to the grocery store. Um, today is going to be not really a big grocery haul. We already went to the grocery store. But uh, I didn't realize, A, I need chicken. And then B, I kind of want some tuna because I had that instead of my, I, I didn't, I didn't thaw my turkey last night. So I threw, uh, threw tuna in instead because I didn't have any other meat. And uh, it actually was pretty good. That was some uh, sweet and hot mustard. So we are about to go there now. And I'm pretty pumped. Uh, I got to get some other stuff for the kids. Let me tell you what, man. If I would have started trying to diet before kids, I think, and I, not that I didn't try, right, but if I would have had the same uh, inspiration, motivation, determination, whatever you want to call it, as I do right now, where I'm really pushing, before I had kids, that would have been 20 times easier, man. I mean, at least, because now, right, nothing I want in the mail. Um, because now as we go, I've got to watch my kids eat. Like I got to make granola bars. I got to make mac and cheese. I got to make not necessarily great foods, right? But the foods that look a lot better than what I'm eating. We are going to go to hy V. I'm going to get chicken, tuna, and some hamburger helper because my kids like hamburger helper. But yeah, so I'll take you guys with me. We will see, um, all the stuff that unfortunately I want to eat, like, there's a sushi spot right in the front and it's the absolute worst every single time. I would absolutely love to eat their sushi, but unfortunately I can't. So instead, I will get some solid white tuna. I wonder if I tried smoked tuna and rice, if it would be just as good, like as like a poke bowl per se. Probably not. I don't even know if they smoked tuna before they, uh, Excuse me. <sighs> Damn. Uh, a and really not sitting well with me. But, uh, yeah. I am excited. I am under 210 pounds today. Thank goodness, man. I have been pushing and just seeing 211 for, like, I was like 211, then I jumped back up to 213, and I didn't change anything. Um, and I just kind of believed in it. I don't know what happened that day that maybe I drank extra water the night before and didn't. I don't know. Um, but I didn't cheat or anything. Weight jumped up two pounds and then weighed myself. Yesterday I was 211 again. And today I was 209.8, man. So I don't know what happened, but I'm going to count that as a low weigh-in. Uh, feels good. Hopefully from here on out we're under 210, which probably won't happen. But, uh, man, it sure would feel cool to, to be just in the just under the you know 210 mark so and then once we get to 190s man i haven't been in the 190s in probably six six years i mean it's it's been a while uh and that was just right after boot camp i was in the the i graduated boot camp 170 uh pretty fast after that i was back up to like 190 uh and i was weight training and looking pretty good and then from there, uh, you know, unfortunately just the bull continued and I got back up. I was like 205 throughout my entire military career. So it wasn't like I was super big. Um, I was about four pounds lighter than I am now. Still definitely a, uh, a chubby person, but you know, what are you gonna do? So we, uh, we're working towards bettering that now and you know hopefully I can bring out my my best ever physique because now when I graduated boot camp at 170 man I was like a weird skinny fat because there's no real it's like running there's no actual working out so you know you run a whole bunch then you hike a whole bunch it's all just just endurance based training so this time you know I'm still weight training I'm still trying to keep my my numbers at a decent level and yeah, so I think this could be the, it better be, goddammit, better be the best best physique I've ever brought. Otherwise, I'll be, 
I'll be uh, heartbroken, you know, with with just the amount of effort I feel that I'm already putting into this. Um, you know, we are now five weeks in uh, to the, the new restart of it, right? I mean, it's been it's been a year uh, since I got up to 240, right about 240. So, um, you know, we're 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 just continuing steady, slow. Um, cardio is going to increase this week as calories are going to drop a little bit. Um, and that's just to try and, you know, speed things up. Not, not necessarily speed things up, but keep them going at a steady, steady rate. And, uh, you know, we'll see. We probably will sit at this calorie with this amount. Like, so I'm going to do four days of cardio rather than three days of cardio. Um, we're up to 45 minutes, so... You know, an extra 45 minutes of cardio a week. And... What the frick, bro? Let me show you guys this, man. This is messed up. Of course, I'm dieting, right? And there's outside... I've never seen this before. Look at this. Can you see this? Cheese curds, mini donuts, ice cream, corn dogs, hot dogs. It's a food truck, like, festival over here. At hy V. What? What? Bro. But it's fine. We're not going to cheat. We're not going to go over and not even try to go over in that area. We're just going to go inside and we're going to get some food. And I got scared and I didn't even try to pull the camera out. I wonder if I should try it with my phone first. Maybe that wouldn't be so bad rather than the camera. The camera just seems like this guy's obviously videotaping. But oh well. Uh, trunk's full of strollers. So I've got groceries in my front seat and the back seat there. And we are going to go unload them, obviously. Come on now, there we go. We're gonna go unload them and uh, make some lunch, man. I had a, uh, like I said, I had that rice and tuna bowl yesterday and it was good. So we're gonna have that for lunch instead of rice and chicken. Uh, I'm sure the chicken would actually be just as, like just as good, but Again, you have something you like, you're gonna you're gonna want to have it again. So, super low calorie, uh, low fat, and uh, yeah. I see you, Chief. All right. Other than that, guys, we are on our way home. Um, man, there's something, man. It's like the world knows that I can't have a, a whole bunch of this stuff. So they're going to throw a little mini state fair type thing in the Hy-Vee parking lot on the day I go grocery. I don't even go grocery shopping that often, you guys. So lunch. Solid white. And let me grab. So we're at zero grams. We're going to go to 220 grams of white rice. No way, look at that. Oh, we're gonna keep it at that. Perfect. Now I just need to. Here, man. Do what you want. Don't worry about me. What'd I do with it? For a very long time. And the key is this it's High V brand, apparently. The sweet. Hot mustard, and I'll tell you, man, it's so good. It's not even like a, it's not even like a mustard. Uh, just to see how many calories I actually put on it. So it's saying five grams. It's in calories. I probably put. Let's just, let's just see. Oh, oh. So, I put five servings. So that's an extra fifty calories for that right there. But it's good, and it's worth that extra fifty calories. Plus, uh. Tuna is really light, you know, low calorie meat. So I just kind of trade off through through that, mix it all together. Mm. I'm gonna go eat this. I'm gonna edit this video, and uh, we'll see you at the next meal, guys. Well, you guys look at this. This is exactly what I'm talking about. So we got M and M's, M and M's, banana nut muffins, Tootsie Rolls, like. The world wants me to cheat. That's what this is telling me. What? 
It is technically tomorrow, I guess, is the best way to put that. We put Axel to bed at about 8. Uh, I was about to do cardio like 8.30, then he woke up and stayed up till about 10.30. Uh, and then just did not sleep great at all that night. So, I didn't uh, end up working out or doing cardio. But uh, instead, we uh, are going to do a nice big chest day today. And right now we're going to make breakfast because I love food. <laughs> so, uh, what do I need? I need to put this stack of bowls away. And, oh, I dropped it. This is what my chest is going to look like after my, my chest day. Now, the first step to a successful breakfast is always eggs and egg whites. Now, why do I say that? That's the healthy part of the meal. That's the part that lets you feel like, you know what? I didn't do too bad today. I did a, I did a pretty good, pretty good day of eating, right? You start off the day with a healthy meal. It makes it easier to go the rest of the day with healthy meals because it feels like you've started, you know, you've already accomplished something. Second part of a successful breakfast. Monster. Mmm. Better with every sip. Now, the next part. You take a new bowl, oatmeal. Mm -hmm. In about 10 years, the kids are gonna be old enough to do the dishes, so I actually don't know what age they start, but that will be the day. Peanut butter. Thirty two. Mm, mm, mm. See that smoke? It's cause I'm hot. That right there is damn it. Damn it, bro. I need a I need a videographer or a friend. Applications is down below, man. You trying to be my friend? <laughs> As you can see, I don't know if I'll really call it an omelet yet, because I didn't turn turn it over in half, but you know, you live with what you got. Now, I've got two eggs here. I'm not gonna try and one-handed crack them because I like to keep them unpopped. Because I don't want my eggs to stick. Yes! All right, they didn't pop, you guys. And that's truthfully, that's it, that's breakfast. Where did you keep that? Boom! Crazy. Now, the last thing I need is bananas. Now bananas, bananas are a, a touchy subject here, so we just, Turn one plate into two plates. Magic. Peel our banana from the bottom end because it's easier. And I like easy. <laughs> Just kidding. All right. Woo! Bananas and eggs. Wait. Bananas and oatmeal and then eggs. I'm not just eating bananas with eggs because that doesn't sound good. You already know. Sugar-free ketchup to go on top of these eggs. All right. I'm going to go eat this. Drink this. Drink this. Eat this, then bear with me. 
It's right here. Then, I'm going to drink this. I'm going to do this. Then I'm going to do this. Maybe a little bit of this. I'm going to try to lose some weight, but... God, look at that. Looks like nothing. It looks like I'm not even flexing. There we go. That kind of... The lighting helps, huh? Don't mind if my stomach pops out. It happens. When you're fat. They 
want the best of me now, best of me now, best of me now, best of me. They want the best of me now, best of me now, best of me now, best of me. To God, man, I'ma make it soon Silence all the haters as they see us making moves I do what I want, so I got nothing to prove Staying motivated, teaching others what to do I'm staying focused, my mind is open They start to notice that I'm in motion There is no potion, you're not just chosen It takes devotion to stay composed, man Never stop, never stop, there ain't no time to fuck Try to live, get it up, you got one life to pop Thinking big, never small, cause you gotta want it up When you finally get that up, you get ready, take it up Need a handout, I already stand out Starting to advance now, ready to expand now You don't have a chance now, cause we're in demand now Make it by the grand now, feeling in command now If I succeed To see if I believe They're looking up to me They want the best of me now Best of me now Best of me now Best of me They want the best of me now Best of me now Best of me now Best of me Battery's about to die, guys. That sucks. I need to get more. See you when it charges. All right. Sorry about the camera dying, everybody. Uh, would have loved to show you the rest of the workout, but oh well. Um, we are, again, we're under 210. I don't know if I put a screenshot up yet, but if I didn't, here's one of, or a picture of the 209. Bam! Yes, so, um, you know, I really can't wait to hit under 200, that's my, my big one. Um, man, I haven't been under 200 pounds in probably like five years. So, if I could get under 200 now, you know, A, that's like best physique at least in five years, but hopefully it looks better than it did five years ago. So, um, definitely didn't look great then, but... You know, we've been working out ever since, and, and here we are. So, um, that's going to be the end of the video. You know, stay tuned for the next one. Hopefully, it's again, it's better. I feel like I'm getting better at it. And, uh, yeah, if, if you like this one more than you like the last one, or it's your first one and you kind of liked it, just give me a like. No, give me a subscribe. Even if you never watch another video, help me hit 11 subscribers. Because that'd be awesome. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys in the next video.